Hey guys, welcome back, it's Ari from Intermed School. So, today we are going to talk about binary fission. Unlike eukaryotics, prokaryotic cells have a different way to reproduce. Anyway, also, you should know by now, a prokaryotic is, said, is made out of mainly two membranes, mainly two structures, the cell membrane and the cell wall. And inside the prokaryotic, there is the main large circular DNA in a region called nucleoid and many small plasmids. So, unlike eukaryotic, prokaryotic cells don't go under mitosis or meiosis. They do go under a process called binary fission. Before replication, the main DNA replicates itself and the, plasmid re the plasmids replicate themselves too. So the cell replicates its entire genome, the plasmids and the nucleoid. The cell will also increase its size and we send and will set the new large DNA molecules, the main one, to the opposite poles of the cell. However, the plasmids will be more randomly distributed. So you might get five plasmids on this, this side and like 15 plasmids on the other side. They are more randomly distributed. The process of distribution is complex and you really shouldn't know it for the IMAT exam. Anyway, after the cell has distributed the nucleoids, the new main circular DNA, to the two poles of the cell, the cell will form new cell membrane and cell wall in the middle and will split into two new cells. Like I said before, this whole process can happen in under 20 minutes. So, the growth of prokaryotes are exponential and very fast. Remember that for the IMAT exam, mitosis and meiosis occur in eukaryotics only and binary fission is the way for prokaryotic cells to reproduce. I will see you in the next video.